hi there uh, welcome to nine lean uh, i'm going to show you a very simple way of writing a binary search tree so before i start writing some code let's see the wiki page of binary search tree uh, it, it's, it's nothing but an ordered tree with a, having this kind of complexities and a node which left side is always less than the root node and right side is more than the uh, root node so if you do a in order travel cell we can um, print the things into a sorted way so i'll just write it in a c plus plus this interface which i am using is uh, visual studio you can use anything you like so you have a namespace included and let's start with a main program so basically if you want to have a tree we must be having something called tree class <coughs> and uh, let's call it my tree and there are many ways to create a tree you want to new it uh, or something like that but I would like to show you that I want to have a function called make node and I'll give some value maybe let's say 65 for example and then i want my tree to have some uh, then i want something like uh, insert function where i'll pass uh, my tree and the new number maybe 23 so i'll have maybe multiple inserts function like this i'll just copy paste so i um, change it like 33 45 66 99 0 200 12 and so on and after that i would like to print uh, and do a in order travel so let's see we call a function that interrupt to my tree and then end of the program so um, it's not a test driven development but maybe something similar to that so this is the way uh, so let's start with my tree I'll have a class tree and let's have a public or you can pretty much use a struct tree also so that you don't have to uh, write this public anyway it looks ugly but effectively it's same so the element uh, which I am considering in this tree is this integer value so I'll call this as val and like any other tree I'll have next as well as right sorry it should be left or right not next next is there in left link list here I go I have my class so what I want to do is that I want to first have a make node function and look at this this returns my tree pointer so I'll say return tree pointer at some function like make node it takes a value takes a val correct so what I do here I create a temp tree equal to new tree you can do it in any way just 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 a simple now left and temp tree dot right equal to null so there is one thing which is added in c plus plus 11 which is something called null pointer it's 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 always good to use null pointer rather than null so there is not much difference but null is zero null pointer is good to go ahead with so temp tree even if you null there is no problem with that and i'll add the value which is passed in the function well okay and then return the temp tree Oops, what is happening okay return the temp tree <coughs> now i have this function now i need to write an insert function so if you can see insert is not returning anything so i can very well have white what insert takes tree pointer let's say it's an argument say a tree 
and a value to put in so the thing in insert is that look 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 how we'll do the insert it'll, let's say you have to insert four so you check here it's less fine go here it's more let's go here it's less right then you find the appropriate place to insert the number uh, node in the tree basically you'll have to do maybe the best way to do it in in a while loop <coughs> so just check if val is less than equal to a tree hello well if it is less than yes then it has to go to the left but before that if it is less than this you have to go to the left but you have to check whether there is something there or not if it is there you have to proceed till you find a slot which is empty so here you have to check if a, if a tree left is not equal to null or null pointer rather then you just go to the next pointer or sorry left pointer and program will continue if it is not the case you want to do something like set left and you will say the tree pointer and the value fine and then you would like to break break from the loop and if okay, now if it is not less than or equal to then it must be greater than then you have to see whether the place is available into the right or not same logic which we have used over here so you will say tree or right is not equal to null pointer then then go to right to again continue the loop to uh, the next pointer or if it is not there you would like to do something called set right again with the tree pointer and the value and you break it remember we can put a continue over here <coughs> but it doesn't make it will not make a difference anyway the loop will go so this is it so just for the sake of it and while and it is the end of the function now we will have to have this set left and set uh, right function so it also seems to be void is a good candidate we get set left tree star again a tree int val now what we have to do we have to set a node to the left after three uh, if, but if you can see over here we already have this function make node okay it will give me a tree by putting a val value into the node so why don't can't i use the same thing and just say make node val that's pretty much it similarly i'll do for set right uh, i'll change it set right then instead of left i can use it for the right node then so see we have a tree this is the value of the node the left right pointer we have a make node function which creates the node and sets the value and we have an insert program which goes through the loop and check the free node to insert the function now we have this thing inserted traversal so we need to have a function for traversal nothing so it can also be a good case for this one so in drive is in order traversal in order traversal means left root right so the way it will do is that it will go left then it will put to root 
it will go right again if there is a left it will put this then this then this then this then this then this then this so it, any in order traversal of a binary search tree will print the numbers in a uh, ascending order so what we have to do first over here is that if uh, it's it's a recursive function i mean recursion is the best way to write it in a short way if left is, is not equal to null pointer then what we do uh, we'll again call in traversal function with a tree left node okay so in order traversal is left root right so if you traverse complete the traversal of left node we came to the root i am just printing it over here that value is equal to just to print a tree dot file to have a new line and then write a tree dot write is not equal to null pointer again i'll do in travel in order traversal Come on. of right seems we are done Let, let's try to compile it let's see what the compiler option says success and i'll run it see we get all the values in the ascending order if you see this we have added 65 23 33 45 so all the values we got in ascending order so that's it uh, it's just wanted to show a very simple way to have a binary search tree it doesn't take scarce of balancing the tree because actually binary search tree is a very simple algorithm balancing you have to go, th go through many other things we'll cast at balancing in some later videos so that's all you'll find the code in nanglin.com and uh, keep looking in thanks